Pulse oximeters by Devon Medical Products are used to measure oxygen saturation in the blood. All of our pulse oximeter models come with a lanyard, two AA batteries, and a detailed manual. Many people wonder, how does a pulse oximeter work? To start, make sure that the user's finger lines up with the red LED light seen here. This LED light emits two wavelengths that reflect differently depending on if cells are oxygenated or deoxygenated. The pulse oximeter obtains the ratio of oxygenated cells to those that are not and returns a percentage known as SpO2. A normal SpO2 is generally above 95% but can be lower in patients with certain conditions. To begin using the pulse oximeter, remove the back cap on the unit and insert the batteries as shown here. Once ready, insert your finger into the pulse oximeter and wait for the device to power on. After about 5 seconds, you will see the readings appear. The yellow number on the left is the SpO2. This is the percentage that shows the level of oxygen saturation in your blood. The green number on the right is the pulse rate and shows how many times a minute your heart beats. The blue bar on the far right fluctuates with your pulse to give you a visual image of your heartbeat. The red waveform at the bottom is a visual representation of your heart's activity over the last five seconds. Now let's look at the unit's functionality. Tapping the button once gives you four different viewing angles for convenient readings. Holding the button for two seconds will give you yet another reading. The orange numbers measure perfusion index or PI, which tells you the strength of your pulse rate. After 10 seconds, the screen will go back to its default mode, showing the pulse rate. And here are a few more points about using pulse oximeters. Inaccurate readings are caused by too much movement, too much external light at the reading site, or poor circulation. Nail polish will not affect readings at all. And while fingertip pulse oximeters are very convenient, Always consult a doctor before and after use to discuss your health.